and, and are you looking for work? Well, you may want to consider moving to Australia. Australia's Tourism Bureau looking to fill what it is calling the best job in the world. Could this be your new office? Hamilton Island, off the coast of Queensland, needs a caretaker. Duties include feeding ocean fish, cleaning a pool and collecting deliveries of mail. It comes with a rent-free three-bedroom villa with plunge pool. All this and a salary of about $8,800 a month. As you might imagine, the regional director says response to the ad has been overwhelming. And all you have to do is write a weekly blog. That can't be right. There's no catch. This is a real job. I'll be very good at it. You'd have to remember to feed the fish. Video applications, including one from the Vatican. All applicants have to do is submit a 60-second video to this website, islandreefjob.com. My name's I'm Annie Chi. Right I'm here. Hi, I'm John, and I'm a police officer in England here. You can tell by the silly hats. It's really cold here in Connecticut, and I'd love to go to your paradise. The new job got a puppy on the way. My dad was the great entertainer, Mr. Dean Martin. Do you think all we do is eat sausages and sauerkraut? Well, let me prove you wrong, because I'm definitely not one of them. Here in the north of Sweden, the sea is covered with ice. So if you want to go snorkeling, you need an icebreaker. BBC World. 35,000 people applied. Well, I tried. The search is now down to 50. Only six are from the United States. One Filipino. Seven Canadians. Physiotherapist, a dance instructor, a chef, and three Queenslanders. Just to show you, to do blogging, to do a video. 30,000 down to 50. And of course, we're going to let you know who the lucky uh, applicant is. Slick homemade videos tailored for the YouTube generation. I've got a double rock. Can you maybe just give us an idea of how much time went into putting these together? Sure, mine took almost two weeks to make. Wow. Yoo -hoo, yoo -hoo. Then they make applying look so much fun, it may make you wish you tried for that job yourself. First, there were 35,000 contestants worldwide. Now there are 16. Whatever happens in the final 16, you get to spend a few days on the island, don't you? How, how did you find out? I uh, found out yesterday around 3.40 in the afternoon. I got a call from the uh, Minister of Tourism from wow. Queensland, Australia. Clark, congratulations, mate. You're one of the 16 successful applicants for the best job in the world. Oh, you're joking. Hi, I'm Chris, a musician, age 32. I'm friends with Clark. Um, giving my seal of approval for his application to run Hamilton Island to caretake it. They have every reason to be excited. These 16 finalists have just arrived on Australia's Hamilton Island to be interviewed for the best job in the world. It gives me great pleasure to introduce the new caretaker of the islands of the Great Barrier Reef from the United Kingdom, Ben Southall. Who'd have thought the Aussies have chosen a POM for what is, we're told, the best job in the world. Who's got it? Back at home in Hampshire, oh. two very happy parents. And I look forward to all of the new roles and responsibilities that the task involved. Cool. You say it was too late to apply. <laughs> all of those videos have got onto YouTube, so and every single one. Forever. Yeah. Where do you sign up for that one, yeah, huh? Sounds like tough work oh, there. Watch the whales. <laughs> So if you're not here tomorrow. <laughs> they accepted me. I want to go there. Well, sure, nice work if you can get it. Doesn't come with the boat, I'm told.